in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to create a gig on this particular platform called sprout gigs and i will also show you proof of my withdrawal on live video i have already made two previous videos about this platform called sprout gig and the earning opportunities which you can have basically on this platform i will put links to these two videos in the description you can go ahead and watch them to get a clear view of the platform which is called sprout gigs you can subscribe to this channel to get notified immediately of new videos from here. So if you're ready, let's dive in. What exactly is a gig? On any micro freelancing site, a gig simply is an advertisement or a description of service which is being rendered. So if you're rendering any service on a micro freelancing site, a gig is the actual description of the service which you are rendering. And this service could range from website design, search engine optimization, it could be graphics design, it could be content creation and a host of other things. So a new gig, just come to this gig section and then go to my posted gigs. I have just one gig which is being described here. This is going to be creating a new one. And to create a new gig, you just have to go to this post gig. But before you go to post gig, you have to have two things. Number one, you have to have your gig description which itemizes everything about what you're going to be doing. And then you have to have your gig image. So just come to post a gig. So it's going to ask you for your gig title. You're going to choose a category. You're going to select a subcategory, your delivery time, everything that is associated with your gig. You're going to drop your image here, which is your gig image and every other thing. If you have a freelance link, you can add it here or a link to any of your previous works. You can definitely add it here. So I'm going to go to my gig description i have a gig description already so, so this is my gig description i'm going to be putting up a gig that talks about seo audits so this is my gig title so my gig title says i will do a professional seo audit of your web page so i'll copy my gig title and i'll come and paste it into in the title box so i'll put it since i'm running a seo audit so i'm going to go to i'm going to search a category that matches my intended gig so i'll go to digital marketing so i'll choose a search engine optimization under the sub category all right delivery time is going to be one day number of revisions which i'm able to do is just one and then i'm going to set a price so i'll set a price of five dollars so every other thing here describes my gig it says it says here all the seo criteria that will be highlighted so i have everything which i'm going to be giving out for that amount of money so i'm just going to copy everything here right down and i'll paste it inside my overview here is as simple as this so this is what my gig is going to look like the gig is going to be at the cost of five dollars to whoever is going to want this gig so i would add my image right now i have my gig image ready so i'll just add my gig image and that will be uploaded so once that is uploaded you just go to publish so once you publish it's going to go into moderation it's a gig posted your gig was sent to the admin moderation team once approved it will be published and available to clients so that is just it so i have another gig posted right here so we can see that i have two gigs right now you can still edit your gig you can delete your gig at any point in time if you go to the notifications tab you say your gig has been approved and it's ready to accept offers so as you can see it is no more in moderation if we go to the gig marketplace we can see my gig as a second here so it says that we do a professional seo audit of your web page so this is the gig created so a lot of people will see this gig and will definitely so request So the second part of this service. video is about how to withdraw my earnings or how I withdraw my earnings. So to withdraw your end money on this platform, you just go to your wallet section. When you get to the wallet section, then you click on request withdrawal. So I have just $13, $13.2 really on this platform right now. And there are a lot of withdrawal options you have ATM, you have Litecoin, you have PayPal, you have Uphold and then you have Skrill. But it says to withdraw you can you must have over five dollars in your end balance i have 13 dollars so we'll use that to try it out so it says i can withdraw 13 point up to 13.27 dollars so i'm going to use litecoin which is easy and then i'm going to withdraw to my litecoin binance litecoin account all right so it says my withdrawal fee is going to be 2.39 i'm going to be receiving like 10.43 to 10.8 dollars the fees and the exchange spread so it's going to cost me about 2.39 dollars so 
um, I'm going to go back now to my Binance account. So I'll open my Binance account and then I'll pick my crypto wallet address and I'll paste it in. I'll paste my crypto wallet address. We click on send the token. So now I'll click on submit request. My withdrawal request has been placed of $10.43 and then I'll come back once this has landed in my Binance account so that we'll, we'll see. So I just got a mail from Binance. I think the mail came in at around five hours ago, and that is 17 hours after we initiated withdrawal. So it says my deposit to Binance was successful. It says my deposit of 0.188 LTC is now available in my Binance account. So it said I'm inside my Binance account right now. So inside my Binance account, I can see that the balance has grown from $44 to $55, which confirms my deposit of ten dollars into the account so let me go to deposit in order to confirm we we'll go to deposit so if you come down to recent deposit we can see the transaction we can see the transaction here which says completed so this is how you can withdraw your money from sprout gigs and then deposit it into finance using the litecoin option if you are not comfortable with litecoin you can use any other means to deposit your or to make to place your withdrawal you can you can use just like we have said you can use your atm you can use your litecoin you can use your uphold you can use your squirrel and if paypal is supported in your area you can also use paypal all right so we have shown how we can create a gig and how we can initiate withdrawal